And there's a sunset over the mountain. The sunset over the mountains that of the sort you're seeing in some of my paintings. These are the mountains around the campus here, or at the sort of back end of the campus here. A lot of water. And they're the mountains, you might recognise them from in my attempts at drawing them. No, it's just not moving. It's been quite dry recently. It's all lotus. You can eat the lotus root. Where's a snake? Yeah. Where? Stuff. No, it's a duck. I thought you had your glasses tested. Your eyes tested. Uh, so that's the business school there. That's a new science faculty. No, that's the library. That's the new library. Uh, that sort of red building is where I work. Is that the science faculty? Where's the new science faculty? I can't see it. Yeah. Oh, here it's behind us, this side. A lot of dragonflies still around. You can see we're surrounded. We're just surrounded by mountains. <sighs> Delivery guy. A lot of faculty live up in apartments up there. So they're just getting their uh, their dinner in, probably. Mountains. Sunset. That's where we live over there. on this tree another one over there it looks a bit raggedy so maybe it's the end of the season for these butterflies whose wings are a bit raggedy so maybe this is it this is uh, where they come that one's, that one's not so bad that one's alright that one that one's uh one other one up there. And then another one coming around. Flying. Oh look, there's a whole bunch of them on this. These flowers here. Butterfly Central. Look, there's hundreds of Well, not hundreds of them. There's eight. <laughs> eight of them. That one's, that one's not so healthy, I don't think. That one's not so healthy, but maybe he can fly, even with his broken wings. Is that a song? These are the uh, feral dogs following us because they think we might have a sausage. <laughs> when we haven't bought any sausages with us this time. So... There's the uh, mountains again, getting a bit more colour over them. Up there, right up there, you know, I don't know if you can see it. There, there that's a graveyard up in the hill. Not, not, and it's usually, um, not bodies, it's uh, ashes or just mem memorials. <sighs> no security there today. Yeah. So, this university is still a work in progress. 
it's going to expand into the village over there and I think the village over there over the next five ten years it's all jungly not a jungle around here that's a new student accommodation there for international students and that those buildings there are faculty who want to live on campus that's a new library that's where we live today's a holiday it's a moon festival today everybody's eating mooncakes so no classes today and we have a whole week off so it's a is it China National Day today as well? Oh, National Day is the 1st of October. So they've wedged the two holidays together. Mooncake Day today and Yeah, they built over here. They The last time we came here there was a big hole in the side of the hill and we thought it might be a metro or something coming. But uh Maybe it's water, some sort of... Oh yeah, they did say they was doing some water management. Well, the government is doing water management. So it might be that, because there is a little waterfall here. <coughs> yeah, it's, it might be a water, part of the water management system. Yeah, there's a lot of water here. A warning about water. And, yeah, so... Oh, look, there's an egret. Off. They're very shy. You can hardly get close to them to uh, take a picture. They sort of know. These are very small apartments for, I mean, they're okay for maybe single faculty or maybe if you've got the two of you, but they're very small. Yeah, a big, yeah, yeah, it must be the water, some part of the water management system. Hey ho. That's all student accommodation there. Student accommodation all behind it as well. Quite a lot. Snakes, there are cobras. There are cobras on this uh, on this campus. We have to watch out for the cobras. Uh, a colleague who lives there has seen cobras in these gardens. So, uh, walking through the campus, it's got darker. We were chatting to a colleague. That's the library. This is the business school. The business school, there is a subway in there. Yeah, subway sandwich shop. <laughs> Not an underpass. It's quite a nice uh, campus. Not many students around because they've all gone home. Again, these dark buildings, that's where I teach. business school all the accountants and uh, business majors that building over there is a sort of architecture building and architecture
lot of water around. Watch out for the snakes. <laughs> and look, we've even got a Starbucks. Starbucks, it's only been here, uh, I think, two weeks. Oh, look, there's the moon. There's the moon, it's Mooncake Day. Mid Autumn Festival. My camera isn't doing it any justice. But yeah, there's the moon. Full moon tonight. Full moon. I don't think these girls' phones are doing any better. I think the, the light is too... Yeah, it, it, it's just not going to focus. Maybe. Oh, that's not so bad. Sort of dropping in and out of the focus. Maybe you need to wet the mill come up. It's quite big. It's really big. You can see the man in the moon. Issa can't see the man in the moon. I can't. What man? The face. Oh look, I almost had it then, but it's too, I'm too wiggly. Yeah, there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, back to, back to a normal life. Starbucks. We're not going there. We're hurrying home because we've got a pizza being delivered. Oh, I thought you said after half past six. And it's 18.13 now. Yeah, so those buildings there, that's where I work. It's the main sort of uh, general education teaching blocks. English, mainly. And uh, some of the other, like, psychology, the humanities block, really. We're out on, it's Friday, it's the full moon, and it's the uh, lunar holiday in China, and this is the view over the mountains with the full moon. Can't see what it's like on the phone, really. But yeah, Chinese people will be, will be, uh, eating uh, moon cakes and looking at the moon as they have done for centuries for centuries the great poets like Li Bai would have been writing poems about this very moon enjoy your holiday <laughs>